We need flash. Why? Alright, let's do it. So, also knowing from when me and Ace uh, did this recently, I thought we needed HMs to get to the top, but we do not. So, oh my gosh. Yo, this place would be legit to level up at. This would be a good place to train. These Pokemon are at, like, damn, look at that. That's crazy. These are like the highest level wild Pokemon I ever did see. I also don't think I bought any potions or anything, but I can't really imagine we're gonna win this on the first try, so. Oh, so we do need Surf. Damn it. And no one else can learn Surf. I'm sure. Uh, I don't know what to do then. I'm gonna have to get rid of someone. For, uh, Sharten. Oh, that's the wrong way. Alright. Well, at least I can grab this Ultra Ball on the way out. Yo, this is some nice experience we're getting here. Alright, Sharten. Looks like you're coming along after all. I really don't know who to get rid of. Because Jasper, Yap, and Goldfinger all give me some bomb immunities. Spanky is the chosen one. Gungam is so strong. I can't not bring Bomb Dom, can I? You know what? I might have to. I might have to actually not bring Bum Dum. I'm gonna take Jelly out real quick just because it has the Mystic Water. What? Does it mean my items are full? Um. Sorry, I was thinking about what items I could give that might be more useful. I really feel like Steelix doesn't do that much, but you never know. Having those switch-ins. Oh, Sharten's falling behind a bit though in the levels. That's not good. Alright. Let's put you in front, Sharten, because there seems to be a lot of weak to water Pokemon here. And they're all about your level. I mean, let's see. I mean, who knows? Maybe, uh. Maybe at the end, Red's Pokemon will be so, like, weak to uh, us exploiting our immunities. That we'll just be able to win. Easy peasy. That would be cool. Considering blue took way too long. Oh my gosh. Whoa, what? I didn't need surf. I mean, I'll try sharding anyways. We'll see what, uh... Oop, sorry guys. Well, we'll see what, uh... What this guy is working with. There's so many items. I'm getting, like, potions and stuff just from walking to this guy. Where is he at, though? Should be, like, just through here. Uh, what's up, bro? We're like twins. All right, 
Let's do it. I don't know who we should lead with. Let's just lead with Shartan and see how it goes. <sighs> My man Red. Let's do it! <laughs> Let's see what level his first Pokemon is. Starting with the Machamp. At level 135. Fun stuff. Yo, get attracted. Oh, we missed! <laughs> okay, wait. He has Cross Chop. You think he could touch Jasper? He's gotta have like Earthquake or Rock Slide, right? We can stall him out of Cross Chops. Ah, he only has five of them. Should I go into Gold Finger? Not if I'm expecting him to Earthquake. I'm gonna go into Goldfinger. Yep, there's the Earthquake. Pretty sure he's just gonna Earthquake again. Alright, so yeah, Jasper can't beat this thing. Man, what do I have to beat him a champ? Kinda nothing. Oh yeah, so he is gonna cross drop. Alright, hold up. I'm gonna switch out. Yeah, get out of here. Now he's gonna Earthquake again. I don't have switches for Earthquake! No, it's cool. We're gonna go Jasper. We're gonna Confuse Ray. He's gonna hit himself in Confusion. No! <laughs> Alright. I was kind of trying to do this the whole time, but I should have just done it. Honestly, I don't... There's, I don't even think we're doing half to this Machamp. Oh, we are actually doing half. Yo, if he hits himself in confusion! Okay, nope, that would be too easy. <laughs> Alright, so our whole team is just losing to this thing then. Yep. Oh my gosh, that did a lot. Karate Chupu! Hey. The Chosen One! Alright. His first Pokemon beat five of our Pokemon. So, it's looking good so far. No, why does he have a Vaporeon? Alright, we're definitely... It's gonna have, like, Blizzard, though. Oh my gosh, my team can't beat a Vaporeon, either. I honestly have, like, no options for this guy. I'm gonna freeze him real quick. Hold up. Hold up. Let me freeze him real quick. Nope, it didn't work. Alright, we lost. I'm gonna go back out. Uh, how do we beat him a champ? I don't have any flying Pokemon. I feel like there's no way to beat Machamp. Alright, I'm gonna get rid of Shartan for now. Grab Bum Dumb. Alright, I think what's gonna have to happen... I might try and put him to sleep with Bum Dumb. That might be my only option. I'm pretty sure he's like faster too, so... Alright, I put him to sleep, and then two-shot him with Alakazam. He has to stay asleep for all those turns. If that doesn't work, then we die. We'll have to keep trying that. <laughs> and hope it works. Alright, let's see what happens. I don't, I don't know if I could actually kill that thing. I like that I can walk through here. Has that always been a feature? Or did they just like add that? Not in Pokemon in general, I just mean in this game specifically. Like did I just never need Surf? Could I always just like walk through all the water? 
What's with all these water Pokemon? It's kind of cool, actually. I bet a Starmie can put in the work on my champ. Not really. Oh, gosh. The levels are just too crazy. Oh, I can't escape now. Okay. Oh, well. That wasn't as bad as I thought. I was trying not to take any damage, so. Job well done! Alright. Let's try this again. Me and Red overlooking this beautiful sun... I don't know. We're in a cave. Alright. Let's try it again! He has a Vaporeon. I can't beat a Vaporeon. I really don't know how. I know I have a Venusaur, but he's got Blizzard. Alright, can we at least be faster than this thing? Okay, cool. We just missed, so, you know. Alright, oh, and he woke up the first turn. Yeah, nothing worked out well that time. Okay, we missed twice now. Alright, alright, alright. I didn't mean to click that. <laughs> alright. Put him to sleep. Why? Why is it that hard? Why do we have to take damage here? Why does he wake up so fast? I just want the cards to fall into play. Oh my gosh! <laughs> the Golem, get out of here. Whoa, this thing is at level 92. Alright, anyways. Um, I just want everything to fall into place. So I can at least get past this Machamp and see what awaits me. Got him. There we go. Alright, alright. Hey, Bum Dumb level 86, that's what's up. I got Bum Dumb and Gun Gum. That is a mouthful. Alright. I don't know what to do. Because Vaporeon most definitely has Blizzard. You know what? Let's just do this, okay? Maybe we can just beat his whole team by Destiny Bonding. Let's just do this. There you go! Jasper always being a team player. Get out of here, Vaporeon. Alright, let's try bum them again. Tell me why I was like, wait a second. I feel like something fiery is coming out. Typhlosion's definitely going to be faster than Jasper. Do I have any revives? I know I do. I honestly don't think I can beat this thing otherwise. Hey, if it takes me... I'm not trying to use max revives like that, but whatever. If it takes me... Sacking my whole team with Destiny Bond. No! Damn it! Jasper, I need the Quick Claw! Oh, he has Earthquake. Oh, of course. Huh. Jasper, last chance! For revival! Oh my gosh, he crit me. No! Alright, well. That's not working then. Freeze him with Ice Punch! Yo, nothing is faster than this thing. Oh my gosh. Huh. <laughs> Where's the levitate? No! Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna get my items back right quick. Alright. So maybe I'll actually try and beat Vaporeon. Granted, now I don't think I can. For multiple reasons. Okay. And then save Gengar for Typhlosion, but then I'd need the Quick Claw to go off too. So, a lot of things riding on it. Alright, good job guys. First Mon down. So Vaporeon, huh? So you got Vaporeon. Hmm. 
Hmm. I don't think I can switch around like this. Hydro Pump is going to do way too much to Bum Dumb to be able to live like five of them. Actually, hold up. I have Detect too, though. So let's do this, okay? There's one Hydro Pump. I, I don't even know if this is going to work. I have to see the damage. There's two Hydro Pumps. Oh my gosh. So now I'm assuming he's going to like Blizzard or something here. So then we go Yap. And we dodge it. Nope. And we get frozen. Alright, well that was three Hydro Pumps. We dodge a blizzard. Nope. Alright, we freeze him back. Nope. Alright. We go Jasper and Destiny Bond. Honestly, like, what moves would he have if we stalled him out of, like, Hydro Pump and Blizzard? Probably have, like, Body Slam or something. A Mew at 160? Oh my gosh! What do I have for a Mew? I have to use, like, my... Okay. What is this thing going to do to me? Alright, hold up. I'm, I'm just gaining knowledge right now. I'm going to revive Yap. Okay, he has Sacred Fire. I'm assuming Psychic. Pretty sure Sacred Fire only has 5. Psychic has 10. And now let's see what he has for Yap. Ancient Power, which also has 5. But we've been here before. This is basically Celebi. So he's used two ancient powers. I forgot I had to detect. So three ancient powers. Four ancient powers. And last ancient power. This is why detect is good. <laughs> Alright. So now, he would have Sacred Fire, Psychic, and one more move that I have no idea what it is. He's like double my level, so I can't imagine I'm going to take Sacred Fire well. I don't. I don't take it well. Oh, and he has Thunderbolt! Okay, hold up. I need to remember that. <laughs> Alright. Sacred Fire, Ancient Power, Thunderbolt, and Psychic. Okay. So, we can switch around. We can stall out the Ancient Powers, and then we'd have to stall out... I don't think we could stall out T-Bolt and Sacred Fire. Because we don't have anything to take Sacred Fire. Because if we stalled out Psychic, then he's firing off Sacred Fires and T-Bolts. Which... Nothing on our team wants to take that. He's also, you know, 60 level... Or like 80 levels ahead of us. Freeze him, Spanky! Okay. It was all about the knowledge. And now we know that we're even more screwed than we were before. Nice.